My quiet place is actually my favourite place. <laughs> it's the place that I make sure all distractions are removed. And it's a very sweet place for me because I don't have to be anybody else, but I can be honest and I bring everything before God. But I also would quiet myself to be able to hear him speak. And for me, it looks like either at a cafe because so I get distracted in my house. So I have to go out and I drive and I bring my headphones, I bring a black art line pen and I bring two highlighters and a couple of different versions of the Bible in my journal. Because I get distracted um, quite easily, I have to listen to music, but it can't be anything with singing because I just get too distracted. I'm like, oh, how did they sing that? I'm like, that sounds cool. So what I actually do is I put on, this is embarrassing, but it's true, the Hillsong Kids um, piano worship album, which is all of our songs, but just piano. I listen to that as I read my Bible and I journal, and I feel like it's in those moments that God speaks to me about not just the season that I'm in, but things to come, and He starts to drop things um, in my heart, and I write it out, and it's amazing to look back over it um, in the weeks and months ahead, and I go, oh God, you were speaking, and I did hear the right thing, and look what you did with this, and um, it also gives me an outlet to be able to be so honest and it's, I was reading in a book that um, it's called about ordering your private world and you should have a journal that's so honest that you'd be embarrassed for anyone else to read it. And it is true, I'd be, I'd probably die if someone <laughs> read my journal because it has every part of me in it. But there's something about being able to be so honest that's quite freeing. Um, and once you give it to God, you don't have to hold on it, onto it anymore. But even when I'm away on tour, I'll go find a little cafe by myself and just having those two hours of stillness and presenting my life before God and just, I guess, realigning and renewing my mind is so important. And um, sometimes it looks like having that on, the, on an aeroplane because, you know, at however many thousands of feet, no one can reach you. And if you choose not to buy the Wi-Fi, which I don't, um, I'm forced to have like this amazing communion with God and they're definitely my favorite places because when I have that, everything else comes into alignment and has that godly perspective. <laughs>